Some say they are African because of the color of their skin. Others say they are African because they were born on African soil. We went and spoke to different people to find out what they think makes them African. Let's check it out. I'm African, definitely. Absolutely, I mean... Yes, of course I'd say I'm African. I would... Yes. No, I would say I am. Most definitely I would define myself as an African. Yeah, I'm an African man. Live in Africa, grew up around Africans. You know, I talk to African people. I'm an African man. Firstly is a contribution to the African vision. Secondly, just identifying yourself as an African. Well, I've been here for quite a long time, since I was 10. Yeah, I get along with the people here very well. And I really enjoy staying here. Why? Um, I, I see myself as African because we live on the African continent. Well, the geographical reason because I'm on the African continent. Sure, that's a difficult question. The fact that my hair doesn't move in the wind. <laughs> the color of my skin, the languages that I speak, the fact that I have rhythm. Yeah, those are things that make me African. Born and bred. I was born in Africa and me being black sort of makes me African in that way, yeah. So you're born in the colors of your skin is going to determine you know which continent you're from and yeah being african is possibly a way of life because there's a lot of tradition and a lot of lessons learned from being african and a lot of uh proverbs as well that are mind provoking as well and that's what makes you think that you're african even if you can be anywhere in the world you can still say i'm african and i can feel african even if i haven't been here for a while now with me is head guide at the origin center brian mohaki he's here to give us more clarity on what being an african is so brian what would you say defines an african an african one is human and an african two is uh, an indigenous to the continent of africa an african three is the citizen of the continent of africa human a native of the continent and the citizen of the continent. And by native, what do you mean? Does this mean only black people or everyone who's born on the soil? Native meaning originally or only found at, uh, or only could be traced from the African continent. That would be the native. Meaning uh, if you go anywhere else in the world, everybody could point at you and say that is an African because the native of the continent uh, are known everywhere else in the world as African by virtue of the color of their skin and uh, mostly the color of their skin, yes. So you'd say that one is, is partially or, or one is defined by the color of their skin? Partially defined by the color of their skin, which takes us to the third one which is the partial part. Uh, after about 500 years or even 2,000 years, uh, the continent has intermarried with quite a lot of other uh, uh, races of the world, which actually shows that uh, to be an African would also mean a citizen of the continent and would also mean born onto uh, the continent and so on, yes. So what you're saying, I gather that, yes, you are African if you are born on the soil, you're also African if you're black. So say someone who lives in America who's black, you could call them African. You could call them African because their origin is in Africa. And uh, because, of course, of about 500 years of them being moved to another continent, they could be uh, descendants of the African continent, but they could also be citizens and uh, citizens of another country as descendants of the continent, yes. The 25th of May, the celebration of, of Africa Day. What are you guys going to be doing here at the Origin Center? Are you gonna have, do you guys have anything planned for the day? Uh, normally, in during holidays or public holidays, uh, people are actually allowed to come to the museum. Well, they would pay the basic amount of uh, coming into the museum. But currently, we haven't actually planned anything formal yeah, in that sense. But uh, just like any other public holiday, we do uh, let people uh, in, meaning they have to pay to come in and see the story of human origin and see how the African continent ties to being the cradle of humankind. 